Hey guys, what's up? It's Alex over at Laser Everything and I'm coming at you with a really quick two minute tip. Here we go. Break the target, go! Hey guys, for today's two minute tip, I wanted to talk to you about the dangers of plastic coating on mugs. All right, well, not really dangerous, but it can take a mark that's supposed to look like this, nice black finish on that stainless steel tumbler, and it can turn it into something like this, okay? So go ahead and take a look at that, and you can see uh, that is just awful. It looks horrible. We're gonna go ahead and switch over to the macro over here uh, in just a second so you can really see the difference between these two. Um, but this is uncoated steel, and this steel has a coating of plastic, and you can see it right around the ridge here. Uh, we really don't want to try to engrave this. If you engrave this with a fiber laser, it's gonna bubble up and melt. If you engrave it with the CO2 and you try to use something like Brilliance Laser Inks, uh, it's just not gonna stick, okay? Uh, and this line right here is just a telltale sign. You can almost feel it. And, you know, we all make mistakes. I wasn't really paying attention when I started this job and I went ahead and I ran all three of these uh, that I had to do for the customer through the CO2 with Brilliance Laser Inks and it just did not stick. Uh, and that is because of this plastic coating on here. I, I just wasn't paying attention. It looked nice and black when it came out of the CO2. But when you go to rinse it away, it doesn't look good. Even when I'm just holding these two, you can see the color difference. And if I was paying attention, I would have noticed this before. You guys want this result over here, okay? On the right, you do not want this result. Um, unfortunately, I don't have a way to really deal with these. Uh, so usually I just tell the customers no. I'm gonna have to explain to this customer uh, that it just didn't work out this time and I'm not gonna be charging them for it. Uh, so learn from my experience. Okay guys, beware. We do not want to engrave plastic coated items. We just want to engrave that nice juicy raw steel. Complete. Thanks for watching guys. This has been your two minute tip. If you got value out of it, go ahead and hit the like button. Uh, if you really liked it, you can subscribe and turn on the bell notifications so that you get notified the next time we post a new video. If you really, really loved it, you can go ahead and check out the Patreon. Uh, it helps support the channel, make sure that I can keep continuing to make these videos. Uh, there's also the Discord link down there, which will take you to our Discord server, where you can meet up with a bunch of other laser engravers who have a lot of experience doing this, are happy to help out, answer your questions, and uh, you can get to know the community a little bit. So I definitely recommend checking out that. Uh, but for now, that's all guys. Uh, I don't have anything else, but I've got a lot of other videos to shoot. I've got a whole bunch of tumblers over here that I need to get cleaned. Uh, so I'm going to start editing some new videos for you soon, and I will see you in the next one. See you later.